Hi Pengjun, this is Norman here. Okay, I'm going to keep this video very short and sweet. Uh, the reason why I'm recording this video is because I also had my account banned uh, more than two times in the past before. And actually the very first time my account got banned, right, I actually manually exported all my client's ad sets over to a new ad account. And I remember that it took me more than four hours, so it was really hell doing that. So after that, I actually went to research a little bit more and I found out there's actually a way where you can export all the ad set from one ad campaign, uh, sorry, from one ad account to another ad account. So I'm just going to do a very quick one. Uh, basically, let's take a... Okay, let's say if I take this account. And uh, in order to do the export, right, it needs to be done specifically in Power Editor. So if you were to go over to Power Editor, give it a minute to load. Yeah, you will see that there's this button here, Export, Import. And what happens is when you click on the Export, Import button, uh, you're able to select an option where it says Export All. So after exporting, right, um, then of course it comes to the next process where you need to import. So the, importing, there's, uh, before you import it into a new ad account, right, there's two things you need to do. Uh, actually, just one thing. So this is a pre-downloaded one. You will see that there is, yeah, so when you export it out, it will look something like this. Uh, there's actually three columns which you need to clear because this is actually tagged to your old previous account. So let's say, let me just highlight these three columns, campaign ID, asset ID, and last but not least, there is another one, uh, add ID. So what you need to do here is from this column all the way to the bottom, Let's see if I'll just go all the way down. You just need to clear up these three columns. Okay, so there's one. Yeah, so you just clear up two. And last but not least, of course, the third one. So when you're done with this, just save it and you can actually import all this data back into, into a new ad account. So if you were to create a new ad account, but let's say if I were to create a new ad account. <clears throat> so this is actually a blank account that I actually use for teaching in class. Uh, you can actually import it back, import ads back, choose the Excel file. And just go back to find the file. I can't remember where I save it. Ah, okay. So just to make sure. Yeah, you can actually export the file back. And you can import it. Ah, but I'm not going to do it now. Yeah, so I just want to keep this blank. So once you've done that, all your ads, including the visual, the copy, and all the settings that you've done previously, all will be imported back to your new account. Well, okay, I hope this video was useful. Uh yeah, that's all. See you, have a great day.